Good afternoon, folks. Strap in. We're going to take a deep dive into the clown world when it comes to the latest from the Event Horizon Telescope, their newest image of the central nucleus of the Milky Way galaxy, what they call their image of the supermassive black hole. But now with the twist. Literally. The magnetic field lines spiraling, radially outflowing around it. For those who have been here a while, or who follow Dr. Robitaille over at Sky Scholar, you already know this is not a real image. It's an artifact. Clever data manipulation. And in fact, black holes are not what they think that they are. But can any of you tell the major problem with this newest image, the magnetic fields they are showing here? Well, to start with, we need to remember what is at the center of the galaxy besides the nucleus, the extinct jet, the Fermi and E. Rosita bubbles, the north and south lobes of the galaxy protruding up and down. These are the remnants of a once active jet from the galactic core, and they tell us that it is oriented with its equator at the galactic plane and with the polar jets shooting north and south where the lobes are now. The lobes are in just about every way we can look at it. So why is this a problem? Because it means that this makes absolutely no sense. Yes, the fields take that shape, but they should be cutting left to right across the equatorial region from this vantage point, not wrapping around pole to pole. As you can see in this NASA animation of the galactic magnetic fields, there is a poloidal up and down flow, the remnants of the jet system that used to be in the middle, and while there is the radial spiral outwards, that comes through the plane. And there is no way that this image is what we're seeing in terms of magnetic fields from light polarization from Earth's viewpoint maybe looking down from above, but not this image. When you recall what Dr. Robitaille has shown, the relevant videos are in his Black Holes playlist, specifically videos 10, 11, 12, and 13, which dissect how they came up with that image and how we know they are pulling a fast one on the entire world at best. A truer description is its academic fraud and an unconscionable waste of taxpayer funds. There are two types of professional astronomers, those who have seen these videos and agree Sky Scholar is correct, and those who haven't seen them or refuse to believe their own eyes. It is a fake image. So now, they've tried to double down and show the innermost fields of the grand cohesive system, but they messed up, big time. With the known orientation of the fields of the galaxy, especially in the interior, this configuration is not possible. This is not real, just like COVID, global warming, and every gender outside of male and female. Now, I will see you in the morning for The Daily Show. Be safe, everyone.